everybody, welcome. This is Ido Scordo from Brit Floyd. We are in the in Atlanta, the amazing Cobb Energy Center for our 2023 World Tour, celebrating 50 years of Dark Side of the Moon. And today I want to show you my fractal gear. The main brain is my Axe FX3. I've got two of them just because I want to have a spare unit. But to be honest with you, I don't use it. It's not even plugged. <laughs> Everything I got in front of me, so pedal board wise, they are just controllers. So it's like a remote control for your TV. They don't affect my tone. And if at some point I get lost or there is too much light on stage and I cannot see on that pedal board what's going on, I know that this is always the right choice. And also it's very convenient when you're singing because it's right under the microphone. I've got two expression pedals. One, it's always a volume pedal. And the other one is a multifunction pedal. And I use it for reverb, pitch shifter, tremolo. For instance, in uh, the Gunner's Dreams, I use the Boss pedal for my tremolo. And I like to have the possibility to mix the tremolo while I'm playing. <laughs> Which is really, the, it's really cool, the possibility to mix the tremolo because it would sound completely different if I just played with a tremolo. It's just less effective, it's less. It's just, you know, cooler. I also have that little boss foot switch, which I use as a booster. It's like I think I, it's a good six dBs. And then we have the solo. And uh, there is a little lick in money uh, that I use it for the pitch shifter because I don't have 24 frets on this guitar. And so, you know, <laughs> I have to be creative. <laughs> Oh, uh -huh. 
So my XFS has got three outputs running at this time. I have one, which is the main output for everybody, for the, you know, the monitor engineer and uh, the front of house, and also for us. And then I have one set to my left speaker and one set to my right speaker. And I've done that because on one of these two speakers, I want to have chorus. Uh, and so in this way, I can decide the amount of chorus and I also have independent volumes. The speakers are Dragoon speakers. There is an, uh, an Italian manufacturer, it's actually My Guitar Tech, and he makes these amazing speakers, uh, two by 12 or one by 12. I'm here using one by 12, I, I got two, so I can run in stereo. And I cut everything up to 200 Hertz because I don't wanna, you know, I don't wanna be too aggressive with the bass sound. This is my rhythm for what you want from me. And then I have a very gentle distortion sound for the middle eight. That's it, that's all I, that's all I play. And then we have yet another movie. This is the, this is the rhythm sound. And then we have round and around which is the end section of, of um, yet another movie. And we can go to Young Lost. And we have sorrow. One of the amazing things about the Axe Effects is that really feedbacks really, really naturally. And of course I have this sound because if something happens to his guitar, I can throw him my guitar and he can play the intro with with my, and I can control, you know, his sound, so I can put a clean while he's playing the intro. That would be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> and then we go to Breathe Reprise, of course. And I had a chance to hear the original sound, and it's very distorted, uh, because this is just a rhythm on the left, left side of the, of the stereo mix, and this is how it sounds. It's very close to the original. And for this one, I'm using the expression pedal as a boost. We have great gig in the sky, but that's kind of very plain. A 
I think this is just um, a high watt amp with a uni vibe and a chorus and some reverb. This is pigs. This is the lead swell sound. And we have some rhythm in the B section, let's say. Then we have my favorite part. This is the Sid Arpeggio. So we have bricks. And for bricks, I put a little pitch shifter very gently uh, for the main. Just to sound a little more like the original. to Brain Damage Eclipse. This is a very interesting sound because of the stereo image. It's different left from the right, and there is a delay on one of the, one of the channel, I don't remember which one, of a few milliseconds. <laughs> Clips, we have two sounds.
And that's it, basically. Yeah, not now, John. <laughs> So this one is Wish We're Here, which is actually a ton match of the original um, track, of the original guitar. Which is remarkable if you think that the guitar sounds like that. This is my 12th string as plain as day, but clean, no, nothing. Oh, completely, everything is bypassed. So that was it. Thank you. Thank you guys very, very much for being here. Thanks. I hope you guys enjoyed and see you at the next show. Yeah, baby. That's a great way to start it off. <laughs> awesome.